Alrighty, YouTube, what is going on today? We are going to be going in with some skull service that, as you can see, we're already done started off the door. And as you can see, we're definitely going to be going into a decal deco talker first because look at the hand we have a scorpio we have a uh, we, we just have a very good hand actually so what we're going to do here is use scorpio probably discarding the mizuki i believe is that what i'm doing i, I should i should discard mizuki i definitely going to discard mizuki going to go ahead and get us into a brilliant fusion combo uh, so pretty much what we can do here is literally set up everything because now we can go into a Minerva so that can you know get us even further into the game and then man I can't wait for Cybers Dragon to come out but sadly it is not legal as of right now in the TCG and we are playing ranked with these Skull Servants so we are definitely uh, not going to not, not, we're not going to be able to go ahead and you know extend our plays even further than we already could but you know what that's okay I'm gonna drop the seraph knight right there use trick clan to go ahead and come back and pay the smooth thousand then then use the extra normal summon of seraph knight to go ahead and normal summon the dragon and then now we can go into a minerva and then with this minerva we can pretty much you know possibly get hit a white prince possibly hit a sage or something of the sort if we can hit a sage man can we can we can we get a can we get any better than that so as you see we milled a zombie master squid mod and shadal fusion and then i believe since minerva is not a cost squid mod should be able to activate because technically it's a card effect but you know you guys let me know if that it is you know that is wrong that is another thing about dueling book you have to know your rulings you definitely have to know your rulings because if you don't something can definitely happen and as you can see i drawn to a twin twister which is not you know it, it, it's not the greatest but i did act like i drew something very good um and so <clears throat> i feel like that's a okay you know first turn because i do have a deco talker that can easily negate two um uh, and then uh i also have a minerva trick clown stuff like that and then uh, my opponent goes activate charge of light brigade and does not search and so I'm sitting here thinking, yo, yo, what, what? I was like, dude, you, you gotta search. You gotta search. I don't, I don't know what he was trying to do. I don't know if he just forgot about it on purpose. I, I, I don't know. I don't know what he was trying to accomplish with that. Um, I don't need, I, I thought, and when I first seen the first three cards milled, I felt like he just played charge to mill three and like literally didn't play a light sword. So, in phase going to twin twister because as you can see he definitely did not start off with anything he does have a crush card and a mirror force then he accidentally sends his thousand eyes i mean his thousand blades to the graveyard and it's like oh man this is uh this is not looking too good for him and you, you see it does have 1100 uh defense but i'm not gonna act like uh i'm not gonna act like i did uh i, I mean not like i've seen it so i'm pretty much going to attack with what i would have attacked with um, I was thinking about tri using Trick Clown, but I was like, no, it's going to clog up my board. And as you can see, I did not mill the greatest. Still haven't hit a Sage. Still haven't hit a Unizom. We haven't even hit a White Prince, which is a, which is amazing. Or a White Princess. So that's even that's even more uh, you know egregious. But here we go. We just attack with the Minerva. So you know that's just I'm just playing fair because I I wouldn't know what it is and then hit him with cobra and then he does something weird which he, he brings thousand aids a th thousand blades back just off the first attack and i'm like wait why would you do that i thought he, you know i thought he would wait so he can you know uh so he could uh just keep uh what's the name um so he can keep it so then he get a summon raid and then possibly go into a uh to a Scarlet or something, attacking over to Seraph Knight and then, you know, going Scarlet and blowing pretty much all my cards. So then he goes into, uh, I mean, not he goes into, but he uses MST to destroy my Burning Fusion. And I'm like, okay, what else do you got now? Then he normal summons Raiden, uses the effect to mill too. Actually hits another Raiden, which is, you know, this gotta suck for him. But he ends up hitting the other Raiden. Then he attacks my Scorpio, which once again doesn't make no type of sense because like, 
you see you have a thousand dude over there you can easily do 900 damage um, I don't understand why he did that I mean Scorpio really has no effect and then in end phase I kind of see what he was going with he, 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 you see he's playing sort of a light sworn slash uh, what is that one card um, the legendary knights <laughs> Oh man, but yeah, as you can see, he is um he is playing a type of hybrid build, but he did not open up uh, the slightest of good of, of good cards or anything going on. But I do top deck a white princess, so you guys already know this game is just completely over because there's nothing really he can do. Um, man, I wish that uh that one card, like I just said, man, I really wish that Cyber Dragon was out. Did he just change a card or something? I don't know if he did that or not. Did, didn't a card just fly by or something? I don't know. But this is, man, this Cyrus Dragon, when that card comes out, pretty much it comes out in uh, probably, what, two weeks? Yeah, it comes out on the 25th. So, like I said, I can use this Levy Air to uh, get back the White Prince. I'm fin to use. Uh, and then once again, we can just send it to the graveyard for a link summon, which is amazing And then also what can go in this deck is link Karibo Because of the one stars that we do have access to and that's just so fucking good So here I'm going to use a uh, white prince to banish to get the king of the skull servants on the board um, And then uh, I believe uh, I, I don't know. I'm just trying to get game right here. This game is already over by you know how much I have on the board, but I'm just trying to beef up my what's name to beef up my king of the skull servants because that's what this deck is. We, we're playing skull servants. We want to get king of the skull servants out. We want to beef him up. We want to do some good things. So I discard the army and detach the white princess, and I believe I get the lady in right right back in defense and i believe uh i use mizuki to get the white princess back <laughs> use the effect to dump some more cards because why not so as you guys can clearly see i already uh, att attained game just you know just just doing just doing the mad the, the good things that uh king of skull servants do do uh and then my opponent just rage quit so <laughs> that really rage quit but uh, the game is pretty much over so as you can see this is the deck list uh and it is sent in by R random nine or ix the way you know the way i call them usually so yeah thank you guys for watching i hope you guys did enjoy this duel i definitely got two more for you guys today so if you guys stick around you will be uh rewarded with two more